Hey, it's Brandon with Diamond J Customs, and today we power up our plasma cutter to make our very first cuts. If you're new to our channel here at Diamond J Customs, we manufacture ATV suspension kits, and you can find those at diamondjcustoms.com. This video is mostly us just figuring out the plasma table, the plasma cutter settings, and if you yourself are new to plasma cutting and you're figuring out how to cut different materials, I'll do my best to provide the settings we used for each cut. In this video, we are cutting 16th inch aluminum and 8th inch mild steel. Um, we have an 85 amp hypotherm plasma torch that we are cutting with. We cut at both 45 amps and 65 amps. And throughout the video, you'll see us making numerous different cuts, adjusting speed, torch height, um, voltage, amperage. If you have any questions throughout the video, feel free to leave a comment. I'll be checking to answer any questions that pop up. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you enjoy the video. If you do, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe for future videos. Our next videos will be getting back to our sport quads, a Raptor 90 dual A-arm kit install. Thanks again for tuning in. Enjoy the video. <laughs> Nice. I mean, that's about as good as the first cut you can hope for. Yeah. <laughs> Seems pretty good. Hey. The dross is on the top.
faster one. This one's the faster one. That one's the faster one. All right, I hope you found that video helpful and entertaining. If you did, hit that thumbs up button for me and subscribe for future videos. Um, we have started getting into making formed parts by simply cutting slits into the bracket, putting it in a vice grip and bending it to form what we need. Then you can go in and weld these slits to give it the strength. Um, <clears throat> feel free to comment any questions you have. See ya.